Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. In the last episode, we found Shadow, and I made a couple of mistakes that I fixed. Don't worry. I went back, and I sent the carrier, the carrier pigeon to Mobliv, and I went ahead and, uh... That's not the right button. Uh, where is it? I know, I went back, and I got it. I, went... I posted it on Twitter, but I know not all of y'all follow me on Twitter. There it is. Yeah, I went ahead and got Striker because we need this to permanently recruit Shadow. First, uh, how you doing, buddy? You okay? No need to worry, it's just a scratch. Also, he's so good, he's gonna stand guard, so just, you just relax. Also, you guys corrected me last episode, Shadow is not actually a girl despite the pronouns used for him. It's just that, apparently, if you fail to uh, save Shadow back on the floating continent, you will find Realm in his place. Luckily, that is not the case. So, anyway, uh, is Realm, like, here? Did her and or Strago just, like, make their way back to Thalmasa? Oh, there's the burned out house. All the fun places are gone now. Yeah, you can thank Kevka for that. It's locked! It's burnt to shambles, but you still felt the need to fucking lock it. Okay. Uh, anyway. Realm? Strago? Oh, wait. This is the exact same house that I just went into. Also, apologies if you guys hear me get a little bit sniffly this episode. I've, I've got something coming on. It hasn't quite hit yet, but I get the feeling I'm going to be very sick very soon. It's only been a year since the world changed, but it feels like forever. Yeah, that sounds about right. That's what happens when big shit changes. Okay. Hello. After the end of the world, I woke all alone in Doma Castle. When I would try to sleep there, demons would come for me. Ugh, I don't want to remember that. Ooh. Is that an optional dungeon or something? Okay, here's the inn. Realm and Strago are not here. Nobody in the town seems to have, like, heard of where they went. For the first time in 50 years, Ebuck's Rock is above water. Head north and head north of town if you want to see it. Hmm. Maybe. Okay, those are the shops. I doubt that they're there, so I guess all I can really do is just go back and rest. Excuse me. Roman Stregor. Basically nowhere to be found. I mean, you guys have given me a hint at where Strago is, but I have zero idea where Rome is. Anyway, I guess we'll just rest here. If, if I can. Hello? You okay? Yeah, it's just the same shit. Okay, so... I guess we just, like, go rest at the end or some shit. There's no signs of our friends in this town, so... And we can't sleep in Rome's bed. Shago's bed? I don't know which bed is which. Hello, kind sir. Let us stay the night, please. Thank you. Okay, it's been a day. We've dressed Shadow's wounds. Let's go see how he's feeling. Oh, that's a wall. Wakey, wakey! Eggs and bakey! How you feeling, buddy? Uh... Okay, I guess... I guess we can just, like, move about freely now. Shadow's just gonna, like, rest up here, I guess. So, I think I know where our next stop is. I think I wanna go to Mobliz next, because... 
you know, Cyan might be there, and while he's not the most useful party member, it still would be good to have him among us. Because it'll trigger the ability to change party members with five people among us, and actually, I said that this rock was important or something. Oh god! Harpy! Ah! Get out of here! Shoot it out of the sky, Edgar! Also, I was supposed to do something for this episode that was going to make me hopefully perform Saban's Blitzes a little bit better, which is something that will actually let me use diagonal stuff, but it's late and I ended up forgetting. I'm sorry. Okay, so there's nothing here. Nothing but harpies. I feel a little bit betrayed. In the meantime, I believe Mobliz was on the other end of the Serpent's Trench. So let's see if we can't get there. Land. Thank you. Mobliz. Okay, here we are. Cyan, where are dogs? Hello, dogs. Yeah, hello, child. Ah! Someone's coming! It's okay. We are, we are, we are friends. We are friendly friends of the non kesta worshipping variety. Hello? We're, we're, we're looking for a man. He has a sweet mustache, and, and he talks like somebody from... From, from the old Dragon Quest games? You're gonna have to fight your way in here, chumps! Uh, uh. Tara! Holy shit! Holy shit! Mama, are these your friends? And uh, Tara! What have you been up to in the last year? Still a holy shit! Oh, I'm so glad to see that you're safe. I've missed you. Tara, come on. Let's go. Unless we stop Kefka, all's lost. I... Come on, Tara. I... Tara! I... Tara, come on, honey. That is... I... Um... I can't fight any longer. Tara, sweetie. The very day the world fell, Kefka turned and current turned some kind of beam on this town. Almost all the adults perished trying to save their children. Oh. It's heading this way! Protect the kids! Jeez. Papa! Mama! So you've been here taking care of them this whole time. There were only children here. The moment I arrived, I felt needed. You can't take Terra away! Dwan, please excuse him. It's just that if Terra goes, she takes away with her the very spirit of our survival. Oh, jeez. These kids need her. I don't know why these kids need me. But they've made me feel things I've never felt before. Semblance of family, right? The moment I sensed this, I lost my will to fight. I can honestly say that I don't know what's going on inside me. And the more I try to understand it, the less inclined I am to fight. Tara. If you don't help us take down Kefka, these kids may meet the same fate as their parents. Come on. 
I can do, huh? Our papa and mamas are gone. Dawn and Katerin are the oldest ones here. Everyone here calls Tara mama. I saw Dawn kissing Katerin. A badly wounded soldier passed away here in Moblitz. Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me that was Cyan. The light took everyone. Everyone. Dad. Mom. Oh, these poor kids. You're not gonna take Tara away, are you? Uh Orphan guilt! The worst time the worst kind. But oh, it's just a soldier passed away in Mobl oh no. Oh no. Please don't tell me that was Cyan. Help! Run! Funbaba's coming! Who? Who? What? When? Where? Why? Kaiju? Giant monster? Funbaba is an ancient demon who was released when the world was undone. Oh no, oh no! Oh no! We're morphin'! Oh, oh no, oh no, lightning heals him. Come on, can I, can, can I go again? Magic, let's see what this guy's weak to. Twenty six, sixty thousand HP, weakness against poison. So, what we want to use is. I never taught Terra Bio. Fuck! Oh, that's not good. Everything else did zero damage? Oh god, please don't tell me that's not the. Oh no. Oh n oh no. Oh, I think I messed up horribly, terribly, awfully, just- oh, oh no. Oh, fuck. Oh no. Uh, maybe ice then? Nothing. Oh, now she's reverted back, oh no. Come on, girl, keep yourself alive. Oh no. Blowfish. What? Oh god, I don't stand a fucking chance against this guy, do I? Okay, so magic attacks that aren't bio don't work, so punch him? Nothing. Can she run? Can't run away. Oh no. Uh, drain? Does drain work? It heals her, but it doesn't- What? What even? Okay, uh, dream scan sleep warp. Uh, sleep? Yeah? Nothing. Oh, there's just not a lot I can do. Maybe if I try using a summon? Terra has no Esper on her. I guess I'll just accept defeat and see what happens. Annihilated. 
Yep. Can't do shit. Fuck. Terra, wake up! Uh, oh no, here it comes. Alright. You fucker. You have messed with the wrong people. Because you messed with our friend. And guess what? Terra may not know bio, but Celeste sure as fuck does. Staying here. As you can see, I can't be of any help to you. And besides, the children really need me. But Tara! Maybe after a little more time passes, I need to understand what's happening to me. I'm sorry. I'm staying. The children need me. Nothing we can do to convince Terra to come with us. Not now, anyway. There's. Uh, thanks for scaring Punbaba away. In his haste, he dropped this. Here! Received the Magisite Fenrir. Bitchin'. Uh, but Terra is so upset and confused. This is our village. You can't just waltz in here and start barking out orders. Terra's helped us all to survive. Ever since she's been here, we've hoped hopeful for the future. Ugh. So I guess now, I guess all we can really do is just look into the uh, rumors of that wounded soldier. The one that died. Here's hoping that it wasn't science. Looking here already? Yes. This is where this is where the children go. So no hide nor hair of what the hell cyan is, I guess. Hello, uh, hello, other dog that is not interceptor. All right. So if there is anything I can do right now to help Terra. You guys just go on ahead and let me know, but for now, uh, let's see, where, where other towns, what other towns can we go to for our friends? There's the Velt, and I've been told I can find Gao here, but apparently I need three party members, not a full party. No towns over here. Okay, what what town is this over here? This is Sozo. Seems you have a decent magistrate. No, I already know plenty about Esther's. There's a bird here. That bird went to the roof. Oh ah shit! I forgot! Zozo is still fucking filled with dangerous monsters!
and get out of here. We are, however... Oh, never heard of those, though. Dude, you're in it! Anyway, we are running a bit low on time, so... Uh, if there's anything useful I can find here in Gozo, maybe any of our old friends, go ahead and let me know, but until then, I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI, and take care.